three. It's the magic number for the Lamar Lady Cardinal basketball team. All they have to do is win three games in the Southland Conference postseason tournament and the NCAA tournament is what's next. Now we all know it's one game at a time and the Lady Cards played their first game in the SLC tourney today. For more on that, we'll head to the Merrill Center in Katy with Six Sports, Andrew Chernoff. The Lamar Lady Cardinals had spent the last few days preparing for their first SLC tournament game today against Stephen F. Austin, and they were a very confident bunch. The reason why? The Lamar Lady Cardinals had beaten SFA twice so far this season. The Lady Jacks were hoping their third game against Lamar would be the charm this afternoon. Early on, Lamar wants to make sure that does not happen. A great find by Gia Ayers to Cleese Lloyd for the layup. SFA responds. Ashley Mells hits the three in the corner. That gave the Lady Jacks a 14-11 lead. It was all part of a 13-0 SFA run. Off the steal, Khalees Lloyd is able to lay it in. LU led by three at halftime. Scary moment though, second half. Lloyd injures her ankle that she hurt earlier this year, but the good news is that she would return. And who would step up though as she was still nursing that ankle? The answer, Dominique Edwards. Here she hits a three-pointer to make it 58-55 Lamar. The very next possession, she follows suit with another three. She had 19 points in the game. Lamar lives another day. The Lady Cards win 69-65. And after the game, LU head coach Larry Tidwell was proud of his difference maker, Dominique Edwards. Uh, she, hit, she hit the first one, and you can see her, light, her eyes just light up, and she knew she wanted another one. And then <laughs> the thing that was big is she went and got that board. I mean, she went up and just snatched it and put it right back in. And to me, that was the game-winning basket when she did that. If I got anybody, I want to put the ball in her hands at the end of the game, try to win the game. I'll put it in number one or number five or number, or number 25's hands anytime. Lamar's focus now turns to Sam Houston State. The two teams split with each other in the regular season. And it's a quick turnaround because tomorrow afternoon at 1.30, they're playing right back in this arena. So Coach Tidwell joked in the postgame press conference, curfews at 6 o'clock tonight. At the Merrill Center in Katy, Andrew Chernoff, KFDM 6 Sports.